Welcome back to Amori. We're, we're finally repairing these interpersonal bonds. How, do you, how much do you want to bet the mom's going to give a shit when we try to leave? We're going to have to fight her. Oh, wow, she's gone. She's too busy watching all of TV. You are, Bree. You okay? Hey, Kim, I'm good. Thanks for bringing everyone here. Happy end? Hey, guys, guys, we didn't get the devil end. So Aubrey's here. So I'm pretty sure this isn't the devil end. <laughs> you, Aubrey, you've proven any better. We even saved a taffy for you. What happened in there? Your face is all red. You need me to teach someone a lesson. Don't worry about me, guys. Sorry for ignoring you all earlier. No biggie, we're just glad you're all right. Right, Charlie? Yeah. Oh! He spoke! Yes. Aubrey, Aubrey, let's go hang out at the park. I want to show you some cool new moves I came up with. I call this one the Mari because it's dead wicked. I was a practice in all that. Well, the Mari <laughs> was buffeting me with psychic waves. <laughs> It sounds fun, but maybe later. I have better friends now. I have some things to take care of. Oh first. no! <laughs> well, I'll hang out tomorrow, I promise. And then they have their own game about reconnecting with Aubrey. Oh, okay. We'll see you later then. Entering the Maverick's headspace. Aubrey, don't keep us waiting too long. Oh my god. You know I won't, Kim. Be back before you know it. Oh, that's a death flag. Basil's gonna kill her. Aubrey, you've seen too much of my photo album. You'll bleed for your sins. Don't look at my photo album with those ridiculous eyes. I'll annihilate them now. There's one thing I want to check before Brazil. I promise I won't make you. Can cry, we take them all to, to the minigame? You think? I don't know. I want to see. Pretty funny. Today's the day. I'm finally leaving town to become a musician. All those big words I said about making it as a star. I'm gonna follow through with that and try my best in the big city. Wish me luck. I should say goodbye to everyone. But I don't even know how I'm gonna break it to my dad. I'll probably let my little sister Joy know first. Who's Joy? Are we supposed to recognize that name? I don't recognize that name, no. Do you want me to try a game? Because I really don't want to risk having yeah, to do a game. I really don't want but... to do one. <laughs> it was just a passing thought. What was it you were looking at? But I wanted to see if that... I wanted to see what that... I just wanted to see if that guy had left yet. Hold on a second. I want to buy a drink. Hmm. No. No. Not this one. What? You're buying soda, but you're passing on good old orange Joe? How could you? I'm getting the banter. Oh, you still drink orange, Joe? It's so grossly sweet. Like it was made for babies. Oh, yeah? If it was made for babies, why would it contain 150 <laughs> me megabits of caffeine per can? <laughs> tsk, tsk. Do your research, Aubrey. <laughs> Whatever. Everyone knows Orange Joe tastes putrid. You're probably the only person in the world who buys I like, this crap. I like orange soda. Orange Joe. Well, now you're getting personal. How dare you insult my dear friend Orange Joe. It's time for a rock, pet rock fight. When was the last time you even tried it? I'll show you. Kel, what are you doing? Ken's design is from like five years ago. And it's expired. I told you. No one buys this stuff. Worry not, my dear friend. No, Cal. Joe. No matter what, I'll still drink you. <laughs> Kill them. No, Cal! Delicious. Cal, can you see? You're gross. <laughs> and you owe me a dollar. 
Yeah, yeah. I'll give it to you later. Hey, Amori, you want to go to work again? I need to give Aubrey a dollar. Who are these people having a picnic? Is that is that Joey? Give us a lot of dog, but she got a big heart. And me, I got some big muscles. Hey, well, looky here. It's Aubrey and the nerds. Fuck you, Aubrey. He came out as a hanging. Oh, you know, pretty good, pretty good. My dad said he's going to take us to a sick party tonight. Should be cool. Oh, yeah, we're going to party. Uh, don't worry, I heard you. I'm oh, going to go check on wait. the picnic, but I want to check all the oh. sparklies. <gasps> hey, Tan, remember when you stabbed me? <laughs> yeah, why, why have we not apologized yet? Because we're not sorry. <laughs> sorry I was so mean to you before. I think seeing you just caught me by surprise. Though I guess that's a pretty crappy excuse. I hope you've been doing okay and stuff. Has everyone just forgiven us for stabbing her with a real knife? I'm sure everything was really hard for you to deal with. Sometimes I think I was the one that should have been there for you. After you entered your house and didn't leave for ten years. <laughs> I don't know if you'll ever really get over Mari's death. But it's okay to take it slow. To allow yourself to feel every emotion. And to have patience. Anyway, I just want you to know I'm more just on it, actually swinging, that I still care about you and stuff. I've been thinking about it since I started, so I saw you, but I think you're looking a little pale. And kind of thin, too. After you move, promise me you'll go outside more often, okay? Man. Oh. It makes me wish I had, like... Friends. I don't know, man. I kind of miss... <laughs> it's a harsh way to put it, but I'm trying to describe... Like, when I was a kid... You know, I used to live in a, in a neighborhood, and I'd, like, go outside with all the kids, and we'd bike around, we'd do stuff. But now in, where I live, you know, all my friends are moved out. But aside from that, that's not really a thing people do anymore, you know? Mm. They don't just, like, go outside and go around the block. Parents are very protective of their kids, yada, yada, yada. And it's like, I kind of miss just being able to go down the street and see someone. But and now it's like, I don't know anyone where I live currently. It's kind of sad. Uh, what the fuck? Aubrey, what's going on? I'm not really sure how, but this trash heap appeared here overnight. I have a feeling the recycled is behind us. What's this matter plot that's been going on in the background? So I'm gonna be stuck cleaning here forever. We are recyclists, followers of the holy bin. As all have littered, all must accept that they are trash. It's like a Doctor Who villain. Reduce, reuse, and recycle. Where's the question mark? Yo, we're getting I don't know. Good good good. This is incredibly uh, menacing. I don't, uh, I, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, oh, that's is a, that fucking... a memorial for Mari? That's pro I bet that fuck it is. Oh, maybe she didn't like it. I don't know. Mm. I don't know what, how it happened there. I'm still unclear because that was that. I think the wording was vague enough. That we can't be sure yet. Yeah, they said chose to leave us the way she did. Which makes me think suicide. Yeah, but... But I guess it could have been, like, maybe she she was in a hospital and she just gave up on living. I but don't think it would be that, though, because we've got, <laughs> we've got no signs of that. Oh. Oh, we can't save because it's not like Mari's. I was trying I to save. This is, <laughs> this is Dari's. Thinking about it as a mimic. Alright. Oh, well, that's me where we're trying to realize where? What? Not me. Well, me was black. The orange cat. Oh. <laughs> Bad end. It looks at you and says, right, "My well, thoughts we'll... will follow you into your dreams." <laughs> oh, this... Well, this is Cal's family. Oh, doggone it! Kale, your old man is such a fool. We're at a beautiful picnic, but I forgot the most important ingredients. Meat. Can you spare some time by some of the good old cheap stuff at the other marts? Here's some cash. Just talk to the meat man in the back. He'll hook you right up. I don't want to see meet the meat man. We have to meet the meat man. 
This is one side quest we can't deny. No, no, Youngins, I see you'll have some trash with you. Don't talk about Aubrey like that. <laughs> Fuck off. Uh, it didn't recycle our trash question mark. What was the trash question mark? I don't know. I guess it just doesn't count. When Baby told me about her crush, I had to see him for myself. So far as a no-show. But Baby told me that we're looking for some- No blonde. way! Obviously fake blonde rig, the Maverick? Sigh. The Maverick? Baby has pretty bad taste in guys. Who's gonna look after her when I go back to college? Oh my is god, the Maverick is gonna get laid? Wait, who's this? Olive Beanie. Looks like the bus is late today. Sorry for stalling so much, guys. I just want to explore before the potential end of the game. I'm trying to do all the stuff. Where's other Mart here? It's right here. It's can't miss it. You can't run in the other Mart. Of course you can't. Which one of these is the Which meat, meat man? the meat man? This guy? I know the meat man when I see him. <laughs> I have one job. <laughs> and it's to sell meat. Imagine you go up to the deli and he says this. What would you do? <laughs> Cry in terror. Just get one. Sure thing. I hope we meet again. Okay, well. Alright, crazy person. Well, we can buy kish fish to feed the cat. <laughs> A bike. <laughs> sure. In order not to though, cause an international but... incident, I will not be voicing the fish lady. <laughs> bum, bum. Go to that fucking fish first. I want to see where it has, what, what, where it will give us some return. The orange cat or Miwo? The orange cat. I come with an offering, sir. Oh. <laughs> we did a good deed. Maybe this so is like worth extra, it. extra worth, worth trash. Maybe. No. Absolutely not. I see. We made a loss of nine dollars on that, but we helped a cat. Thanks, Jan. This is just what I was looking for. I'll wait for some tasty hamburgers. You all should drop by later in the evening. You'll definitely want to try some of this deliciousness. But for now, go on and enjoy yourselves. Whoever is great today. Hi, Aubrey. Right, that's enough exploring. We're, we're ready to go see... <laughs> oh, hi, Aubrey. We're ready to go see uh, Basil, I think. So, you finally arrived at my lure. That's Basil in Activated the car. These <laughs> words to try and go for you. You'll never make it to my okay. house alive. I don't think so. No, this isn't his house. Yeah, Basil couldn't afford this shit. I don't shit. remember where it's Basil is. It's one lives. further down, I think. Yeah, you're right. He lives in like a shack. Oh yeah? How are you going to repair our friendship from beyond the grave? Oh, here we go. The leader. Hey, Polly. How's Basil doing? We wondered if we could hang out with him today. Oh, hello, everyone. I'm afraid Basil isn't home right now. He's in the hospi hospital. Oh, right, because he almost drowned. What? What happened? Oh, my apologies. Let me clarify. Basil is in the hospital visiting his grandma. She was rushed to intensive care yesterday evening. Oh no. I'm really sorry to hear that. Do you know when he'll be back? I'm not exactly sure. Maybe sometime in the afternoon? Sorry. Would you mind if we check back here later? And then after that I came alone? We're all really worried about him. <laughs> I would love to show you how I plant my seeds. Oh, whoa, whoa. I don't mind at all. Please come <laughs> by to visit. I think Basil would appreciate having some friends and Aubrey over. <laughs> and 
happy to know that Basil has friends that care so much about him and Aubrey. Ah, it's nothing. Friends are supposed to be there for each other. I feel the same way about your Kel voice that I think you feel about my Skipper voice. I just adore it so much. Right, Aubrey? Uh, yeah. Sure. Anyways, we'll be back later. See you, Bali. Okay, see you. Now what the fuck are we supposed to do? Get a job? Well, I guess we have to wait until he gets back. Is there anything you guys want to do until then? The <laughs> more sounds like DIY, DIY. <laughs> I'm okay just hanging out and doing whatever. And I vote somewhere indoors. It's way too hot today. Sure, maybe we can hang out at our house a little. And then later when it cools down, we can all go see the treehouse. Oh. oh yeah, we should do that. Especially since Aubrey's with us now, too. Our old treehouse, huh? I haven't been there in so long. Almost a week. Yeah, we haven't either. I think... I think we cut it down. We wanted to go see it yesterday, but it was too dark outside. Oh. We cut it down. How about you, Tan? What did you want to do today? It's your last day, so you should call the shots and speak. <laughs> face. Yeah, you should decide how you want to spend your last day in faraway town. Lead the way, Tan. Yeah, so guys, about that treehouse. I've, um... I've, I've been uh, not speaking for the last couple of <gasps> Miwo! Follow him. <laughs> Jesus Christ, it's Miwo born. Damn it, we lost him. Oh, fuck. It looks like the sun is about to set. Do you want to go see? No, no, no. We. I think mean, this is like point of no return shit. I think. All right. Then what do we do? Go to Cal's first. I don't know what you want to do. Uh, kind of <laughs> fucking the story what we have to save for the day. Well, I don't know if there's like I don't want to miss stuff if there's like events or anything. Alright, well, where should we check? I kind of went around everywhere already. Um. I don't know. How do you know? Uh. Let's go tell the Maverick that, you, that, that he's in. Where's he at? I don't he's know. He's outside of Aubrey's house. <laughs> the final objective of the oh, game oh, is oh, get oh, Maverick oh. laid. Damn it, he's gone. Where is he? No, doesn't he live in like the super religious house? Oh, he does, yeah. Well, th this is the church. Oh, that's <laughs> Which the church. I guess you could describe as a super religious house. Uh, who are you? Oh, it's Mincy. He's the sketch girl we talked to at the very beginning. <laughs> they were in such a menacing position. Uh, I'm afraid we won't be holding a sermon today, but feel free to use this place to collect your thoughts. Everyone is welcome here. Even you, hero. Oh my god. <laughs> I know you are the Antichrist, fooling people with your charm. Don't think you can stop me. <laughs> Check your pockets, there's a bomb. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, where the fuck do the religious family live again? I don't remember. There's one of the old statues outside. Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. Uh, oh. Hey. I thought of Marv's like <laughs> But my dog Lucas turned out the door again. He's always trying to get out of the house. Sometimes I wonder if he only lives here for the food. I know where Lucas is. No, wait, that was Kel's fucking dog I saw. Where'd he go this time? We have to find the dog. That's our objective now. Really? I feel like you're just stalling because you don't want the sad things to happen. No, we're in a happy moment. Can't we remain in this happy state of frame? And we have to progress... The, the episode at some point. No, we don't. We should just live yeah. in this dream world forever. Where's that? We found a coin. I was wondering what that was. I thought it was like a little plug to like connect the car in as it pulled up. Like... Oh, oh yeah, yeah, here we go. We gotta tell him. He needs to know. That's not his room. His room's at the bottom. This is the bathroom. Is Hang on, I want to check. 
is the twins. It's down there. You think I don't know okay. the layout of the Mavericks room? <laughs> you studied it? I've been trying all day to beat this video game, but it's kicking my bum. Sigh. Why is it so hard to find something that I, the Maverick, am actually good at? Now we need to tell Hey, him. there's a woman that wants to, like, actually look at you. Go outside now. Maybe we have to talk to Bebe first. Um. Because we, we only talk to her friend. We should do that just to be safe. Little did you know the stream protagonist was the Maverick. You can't get in that way. Right, no dog over here. I know, I was looking for the dog. Ah, oh, there That's he is! Kel's dog. Good boy, is I? I told my big sister about my crush. She wanted me to show him to her, so we're standing out around where he usually hangs out with his friends. Oh, I guess it's not a quest, oh. I guess it's just flavor. Uh, do you see the dog anywhere? No. Hold on, let me try and tap into the morphogen genetic field. Not fucking googling the side quest. <laughs> Sorry. I'm hacking the mainframe. I remember now. Of course. Oh. I don't know. What? Um, you don't know where to find Lucas? No. He might be outside Kel's house, maybe. What? Alright, I'll try it, but then I'm gonna move the story forward. He's not. Nope. Oh, he's, he's gone. Alright, what time is the episode at? Like, uh... 22 minutes in, so we got time. Looks like the sun is about to set. In a few hours, the sun will rise. Do you want to go see the treehouse now, Tan? <laughs> Tan, desperately trying to figure out an excuse for why the treehouse isn't there. Oh, there must have been lightning in the night. Cal, did you piss on the rug? Wow, I guess you really are moving away, huh, Tan? I don't want to move. When I see this empty house, it all feels so sudden. But for you, moving away must have been a long time coming. I hope you can find some peace out there. Or, you know, some happiness. Isn't this the modern era? Can't we just, like, connect over the net? It's not the same, man. <laughs> There have been a lot of things that were unsaid these past few years, but I feel like once we see the treehouse, everything will be okay. And painful memories oh. that we kept <laughs> to ourselves. But even through all that, I'm relieved that we were still able to become friends again. I'm happy that we're all here with the treehouse, so that we can face this together. Oh, he just realized. It's okay, hero. I'll go first. <laughs> it sounds like, uh, maybe we don't, maybe we don't need to see the treehouse. Wait, why are we doing it so weirdly like this? <laughs> we could face it, face the treehouse. <laughs> hey, Tan, I cut down your treehouse. When you move away, do you think it could be too much trouble if you could... Aubrey! Tan, are you guys coming? Oh, I thought you'd realized. We're having a moment, Cal. She was going to ask me to add her on Discord. Actually, never mind. <laughs> Can I be your kitten, Amori? It's nothing. Fucking hell. Damn. Oh, no. Cal. Cal ruined it. I was in. No poon for us now. Oh, excuse me? There's no poon for us now. Tan closes the sliding door and locks it. Sorry. It seems you fell for my gambit. <laughs> About the treehouse, guys. <laughs> it just was taking up too much room. This is where this is where oh. Mari. Oh. I was right the first time. Okay, Never yeah, mind. There's no doubt anymore. 
Yeah. Oh, so that isn't the tree house. The tree house is further up. It is. Feels like forever ago. I can still remember that day perfectly. No oh, we don't need a fl we don't no need flash a flashback. No, no, we don't. We don't I, I get the picture. I don't need it. I don't need it. That that day was really busy. Stop it, hero. You segue into the flashback. In the morning, I went out with mum to buy some nice clothes and shoes. We spent all day shopping and didn't get home until the afternoon. I remember that day too. I went out to get a haircut with dad. Oh, oh yeah, you were there with your dad too, Aubrey. We were preparing for something, weren't we? The recital. Yeah, we were. We were gonna go watch Mari and Tan's music recital. <sighs> she did it on the day of the recital. Oh. <laughs> I don't want to click Z anymore, bro. It was supposed to be that night. But... When we came home in the evening... Why did we come back here? Even after all this time, I still don't understand why she'd do it. I... I don't think any of us ever will. Hey oh no! I don't Fuck, I can't, I, This hero is... Let's... Let's keep going. Sad heroes fucked up. Okay, no. Why did we do this? We didn't need to see this. I was gonna see that. Oh, the treehouse! Oh, that's cute. The, actually, that's kind of big if you scale it to the trees. Yeah. <laughs> it's so huge! My tree mana. This is where I put Mari's body so it could decompose. Um. Oh. Oh, Tan. The treehouse looks like that first room in oh, white yeah. space. Wow, this place has seen better days. It's the exact same. Well, it's not exactly the same, but it's, it, it's very similar. Yeah, it is. It's got the toaster, the table, the Yeah, but all in terms of layout, it's very different. <laughs> but it looks like everything's right where oh, we left it's it. the same layout-wise. It's not. There's no, Dude, there's no giant staircase. The Where's well, the right giant now. staircase over to the right, huh? Oh, well, yeah, but fucking everything All else is stuff the same. is still here. Hey, look, here's our playing cards. I was the best at card games, wasn't I, guys? Remember, that's that's what we walked in in the very beginning. They were playing cards. Mr. Plantag. Oh, you're so dirty. Look at all these old books. So this is where all my cookbooks went. You could think I memorized them. I think I just stepped on a jack. Ah, oh, man, such good times. Remember when I stepped on a jack? Mm. All toasters, toast, toast. Why did we have a toaster in here? There's a picture. I think that's the last one for the album. Oh. Uh -huh. Huh? What's in the toy box? Kira suddenly looks up. What did you just put in your pocket? <laughs> you can sense it. Hey, look. Ten found a photo of us. Oh, don't look at the back part. We all look so happy. Wasn't there a photo missing from the photo album? That must be it. Hey, you're right, Kel. Take out your photo album, Tam, before I do. We should add it in. I, I the key suddenly implies a lot of things. Um, Wait, it's like, it's like what's fucking in the toy box? Trap. Hello. So you love your sister, huh? If you want to escape, you'll have to climb to seventy up. feet of her entrails. Game over. We got them all, all the keys. And I wanted to read that one. Right, now the photo album is complete again. You know, this is the, probably the last time that we'll all be together here in this treehouse. Now that the photo album is complete, we should look through it one last time. Good idea, hero. The photo album is already out, so we might as well. Right, Tan? Let's start from the beginning. 
I'm just gonna look at the first one again and see if it says anything different. Okay, it doesn't. Oh. I just wanted to see if they were like implying there was gonna be a new story being told. Oh, it's all dusty. Ta-da! Ta-da! Oh, sorry, you got All this. summer we've been working on a treehouse in Tan's backyard, and today it's finally finished. Hero and his dad did most of the work, but Aubrey and I made paper plants to put in the windowsill. We all did a pretty good job, if I say so for myself. Why is Mari, like, reaching through the window like a spectre? <laughs> uh, I think she's waving to the camera. I know, but it's like, it's so creepy looking. Her, hair, her arm does look a little long in that picture, yeah. Oh, Mari. I miss her so much. I... I miss her too. Hey, come on, guys. Why the long faces? Look at Never seen a dead girl before? Together again. I don't care. Mari would be so happy for <laughs> us. I'm so a sociopath. Up. Yeah, you're right. She would be. If only Basil could be here, too. I need to check the toy box. Huh? Hey, Aubrey, what's up? Oh. What? Hi, hi. Huh? Why are we frozen? What happened? Basil, I love that Basil has done something weird, obviously. I hope he knows about it, but she hasn't told us. What the fuck is up? You know, after everyone drifted apart, I felt so alone. Rip Kim now and I realize that I was the one who was pushing everyone away. And a few months after Mari died, everything changed so fast. Tan and Basil became more closed off. Kel made a bunch of friends playing sports. And Hero always seemed to be busy studying. I was so angry and how life kept moving on. I felt like everyone abandoned me, and abandoned Mari, too. And I couldn't see that everyone was dealing with the pain in their own way. After Tan started coming to school, I saw Basil sitting alone during lunch. So I asked him if we wanted to study together in his house. He seemed kind of uneasy about it at first, but after I begged him, he agreed. The walk there was really quiet. What fucked up shit was in Basil's house? Basil wouldn't even look at me. When we got to his room, I tried to talk to him, but he said he had to go to the bathroom and ran off. That's when I spotted his old photo album on his bookshelf. Oh, that's why she took it. I just wanted to go through the photos because, well, I guess I just wanted to see everyone happy again. But when I opened it, Basil had blacked out all the photographs with marker. I couldn't believe it. It even blacked out Mari's face. All our memories together. I felt like he had destroyed them. How did she clean them? I was so confused and angry. I thought he was a nutcase. So, instead of trying to understand him, I stole his photo album and started calling him creep and things like that. And eventually, I wasn't the only one calling him names. I feel like scum for that now. But you know what? Ever since then, all I've been doing is trying to cut myself off from everyone. It's kind of funny. I became the Joker. What I've been doing is worse than what Basil did, yet I'm the one who was angry at him. Such an idiot. Tan backs away. Why did we back away? I'm not good with public displays of emotion. Hey, it's okay, Aubrey. We've all made mistakes. At that time, I didn't really understand what was happening. I was afraid that I'd somehow make things worse. So I just decided to stay out of all of it. I'm really sorry, Aubrey. And I'm sorry to you too, Tan. I was a pretty crappy friend. Yeah. 
you were still pretty young then, Kel, but I'm the oldest. You mean, I mean, you, I did vanish for years and you only came to see me like a couple of days ago. So I yeah, should have known to take care of everyone. I, I just... Uh, no, it's fine. Everyone's here now. So it's okay. I don't... I don't deserve friends like you. Don't be silly, Aubrey. Of course you do. During all this time, it's pretty obvious you still cared about us. I mean, just look at the photos in the photo album. There's no trace of any of the black monks you were talking about anywhere. You can see all our faces just fine. I so suppose they all just cleaned themselves, did they? It's all right, Aubrey. I promise from now on I'll always be there for you. Yeah, I promise too. Sounds like I won't. I'm moving. <laughs> yeah, I'm moving. <laughs> we should all be here for each other. Let's make a Discord server for all of us. <laughs> hey, you know a group what? Chat, if you will. I think this is the perfect time for a big group hug. Group hug? Oh yeah, count me in. Wait just one second. Ready and ready or not, here we come. Oh, he's pushing us in. <laughs> Release me. Oh. <laughs> I I don't know. I'm clicking. Oh, there we go. We should go see if Basil's home back home later today. I need to apologize to him. And I think right now, he's probably the one that needs us the most. The final boss, if you will. I still I still want to know what the fuck's in the toy box, so yeah, you're going to have to wait. Yeah, I was going to check the toy box, but it's like fucking saw trap. Alright, can we keep the episode going for the sake yeah. of the toy box? I want to... Yeah, absolutely. Where was the toy box? Because I, I swear I remember that item being brought up before. The toy box somewhere. Is it in a hat room? We don't have a toy box. We, we definitely did before. Cal stole oh, our toy box. It's gotta be a toy box. You think? Is anyone in the mirror? Despite everything, it's still you. Not in here. There's, what if it's in Mari's going on like, that message? invisible room? Oh, that we can't go in because yeah. we're too much of a baby. <laughs> Cal, I need you to push me forward. <laughs> Is that toy a, box? No, that's a shoe rack, which I suppose no. could be a toy box. Let's just go see Basil, I guess. Or should we end it? It's up to you, man. I would love to keep going, but I know you're the one who has to render and upload it, so you tell me. Let's leave this episode now, and we'll do one more. No way! Okay, we don't have to, but... You, you mean it? You want to yeah. do that? Yeah. Alright. Because we're Well, friends. everyone, thanks for watching. Uh, does that mean we're uploading three tomorrow, or no. just two, and we'll have no, one ready? No, these right. idiots, they're only getting two of these. Ha <laughs> nerds. <laughs> Alright guys, well, see you next week. Bye. Bye. We'll be drinking Amori. <laughs>